Happy words, this is Afrin Ali. I bought the video for uh, plumbing engineering interviews, question and answers. So basically in plumbing, we have covered three parts, water supply, drainage and fire fighting. So I have, I have to cover the water supply and drainage in this video. And for a firefighting, you will see the part 2 video. So, hope you will be get a more information regarding of the plumbing, engineering, interview, question and answers. And basics, you will be get it at least from my hope you will enjoy this video. Kindly subscribe my channel, Afrin Ali, YouTube channel. You don't forget to subscribe. If you like this video, please like it. So I will start to the important question and answers for this interview and text file you will find in the description box so you can get the text file from there. Hope you enjoy this video. Do you questions plumbing engineering plumbing colon one pump head total head equals total section head total discharge head Total section head equals total height from the center line of pump to max height of pipe run plus total friction head plus total surface pressure head is zero W and tank is open. Total discharge head equals total height from the center line of pump to max height after discharge plus total friction head plus total surface pressure head. 2. Pressure head is a term used in fluid mechanics to represent the internal energy of a fluid due to the pressure exerted on its container. It may also be called static pressure head or simply static head, but not static head pressure. It is mathematically expressed as where is pressure head length, typically in units of M, is fluid pressure, force per unit area, often as pi units, and is the specific weight, force per unit volume, typically N slash M3 units. Is the density of the fluid, as per unit volume, typically Kg slash M3. Is acceleration due to gravity, rate of change of velocity, given in M slash S2. Note that in this equation, the pressure term is gauge pressure, not absolute pressure where FR equals friction loss equals 0.1 L equals length PR equals pressure head 3. Total static pressure TSP equals static pressure plus density X full squared 2. Duct static pressure equals total friction loss L slash D 0.0195 VP plus dynamic loss Dynamic loss coefficient VP. Note L and D are in feet and VP equals velocity slash 4,052. For one pound per square inch equals 6,894.7 pascals equals 0 0.0689 bar. One bar equals 100,000 pascals equals 29 and G equals 401 and 2. Oh. 5. How to find pipe DR equals GPM velocity, FPM you will get friction and pipe size from the graph. 6. Isolating valve equals ball valve equals gate valve equals butterfly valve. 7. Check valve equals non-return valve. 8. Pressure reducing valve. Whenever pressure increases the limit, it will regulate pressure and it is connected to BMS system. 9. Double check valve equals backflow preventer. 10. What are the fittings of faucet drainage etc. Mixer, valves, flexible connecting pipes, etc. 11. How to determine stack sizes and how many types are there. Vent stack, waste stack, soil stack. Varies with load on each floor. 12. What are the normal codes followed for drainage and plumbing in set? 1. NPC equals National Plumbing Code. 13. What are the software used for calculating the pipe sizes in hot water cal etc. Comma colon a pipe sizer. Elite pipe, pocket pipe, S pipe, PP calculator, etc. 14. What is use of U-trap and where it is used? 
It is used in drain connection as water seals snow. 15. What should be the max distance between sewer line and portable water line? 3 meter. 16. How much size of clean out is provided for sewer pipe below 10 inches DR? 6 inches. 17. What are the different pipe material used in plumbing installation? Sit acid resistant sit bituminous fiber pipe, vertified clay pipe, lead pipe, galvanized steel pipe, galvanized wrought iron pipe, brass pipe, copper pipe, plastic and synthetic pipe, UPVC, CPVC. 18. What are the important factor to consider while installing waste pipe? Selection of right kind of material. Conservative use of fittings. Right location of clean outs. Right pitch or slop of pipeline. Manner of joining the pipe. 19. What should be the distance between manholes? 15 meters. 20. What are the different materials used for underground water supply? Up. Cold water. CPVC. Hot water. 21. How to find friction in pipes. There is a graph on which if you know two values you can find the others. The graph copy is attached. 22. Stiffness of GRP pipes. 2500 and slash M2. This class of pipe can be used for the earth load truck load plus earth load. Depth that is 2 meters to 4 meters which will not exceed the long term deflection of 5%. 5000. This class of pipe can be used for the pipes and trench depth or depth of cover of 7 meters and 10,000 and slash M2. This class is used for the pipes with depth of cover of more than 7 meters like for 10 meters. 23. 1 and slash M2 equals 1 Pascal. 24. Pipe spool. The term pipe spool or spool piece refers to a prefabricated section of a piping system that includes the pipe, fittings and flanges that are pre-assembled in a fabrication facility and then transported to the field. The reason for pre-assembly is that hoists, gauges, material and tools are available for the assembly in a controlled environment. The size of the spool pieces is limited by factors related to transportation to the site and ability to handle the spool piece at the site during assembly. 25. Efficiency of pump equals GPMX total hex 100 slash input HPX 3960. 26. Jang to pump, service connections details, shown in the plumbing notes file. 27. Class of water supply pipes up PVC CPVC pipes. Dash. Shown in plumbing notes file. Hope you enjoyed this video. Oh, I brought the video for basically for plumbing viewing. This is the water supply and drain is cover the pipe types and everything ahead of the pumps and GPMs. And most likely if you need any questions and answers, so ask me feel free. Uh, and also the text available with in the description box and uh, this is finally about the video and this is part one video and part two video available in next for firefighting is covered basically in plumbing we are covering to the plumbing uh, water supply drainage and firefighting firefighting is a part two video and after that i will be give you the video also for hvac engineers so hope share this video like this video Thank you. Bye-bye. Finally, subscribe my channels.